Goodbye, North American Free Trade Agreement. Hello. U.S.-Mexico-Canada Agreement called U.S. MCA, it sort of just works. M and perhaps this deal that noticeably drops the words free trade from the title works best for Donald Trump. It means, for example, quotas on auto imports into the U.S., while 75 percent of a North American vehicle's parts must be made there to prevent U.S. workers being undercut by cheaper components sourced elsewhere. And it also gives U.S. dairy farmers in key states for Trump access to a Canadian market that had kept them out with tariffs. But there's a key exception that protects another Trump constituent. So you're going to keep the tariffs on steel and aluminium on Mexico and Canada? Un until such time as we can do something that would be uh, different, like quotas, perhaps, so that our industry is protected. We are not going to allow our steel industry to disappear. It was almost gone. Despite this constraint, Mexico was happy with the outcome. This agreement, which has now been signed by the three countries, firstly has to be good for Mexico. If Canada at least won a deal breaker on keeping special trade dispute arbitration panels, dairy farmers say it's at their expense. They fear they'll be sunk by a wave of U.S. imports. But Canada's prime minister insisted this was a fair deal. Free and fair trade in North America a trading zone that accounts for more than a quarter of the world's economy, with just 7 percent of its population, is in a much more stable place than it was yesterday. We now have a path forward. Thank you very much, everybody. The three countries aim to sign off on the revised deal by the end of November, before Trump sends it to Congress for approval. But if Trump's Republicans control Congress for now, there's no guarantee that will be the case after midterm elections in early November. And if Trump's trade issues with Mexico and Canada have been largely resolved, a much bigger trade war with China is in danger of getting even bigger. Owen Fairclough, CGTN, Washington.